Hi guys, welcome back to another episode of Nick's Picks. It's been a while, sorry sorry about that. Um, today we're going to be handicapping Hawthorne Racecourse. Races 1, 4, 7, 8, and 9. Um, so starting out in race 1, it's a one mile pace. Phillies and mares with a claiming price of 4000 A purse of $3,500. So... My first selection here is the number four, Lilac Lori. Uh, you know, uh, you know, Kate, Kyle uh, Kyle Husted sent his horses over to New York for the winter. For the winter, um, he had his first start over uh, on the getting back from the half at Freehold. He got back on the mile at Hawthorne, ran a good solid fourth. Um, I the the angle that has been winning at Hawthorne has been second time on the track. Um, so he ran fourth in his first start back at Hawthorne, and I think the four will be there. He's six to one morning line. Um, the five was a question mark to me. He's been running against Tougher at Hoosier. Um, he, I, I mean, I could think he needs a start, but if you want a long shot in there, maybe, maybe put in the five as in the exotics, and. Here, I like the uh, the seven. This is where my check mark goes. Uh, Brandon Bates made the ship over from Indiana. Uh, he this is his second start at Hawthorne, going for Bobby Small and Brandon Bates. He's a, he came over from Northfield, so once again, first time back on the mile. Um, he should be good second start out with a better driver, uh, Brandon Bates. Tune over to first or the fourth. Um, this is a one mile trot, non winners of two races or twelve twelve thousand five hundred dollars lifetime. A purse of seven thousand or six thousand seven hundred, sorry. Um my so one of my uh, my so first selection here is the four backdoor man, uh, Mike Brink. Mike Brink trains, Mike Brink drives. Uh, he ran, he was running against a little bit of tougher at a uh, Hoosier. Shipped him over to Hawthorne. First time back on the track um, with Mike Brink. He ran a solid third. This horse could get there. Uh, second time on the track. Might be good. At a little bit of a price. He's 8 to 1 morning line. The number 6, Lil Gator. Uh, Ryan Anderson, last time out at Hawthorne, he it was his first time off a long layoff. Ran a good second, ran first all the way and just came in on him. Uh, he had Larry Smith, so going to Ryan Anderson. That's where my check mark goes in this one, and he's 12 to 1 morning line, so hopefully he could get in at a price. Um, my third selection, second time out with Casey Leonard, Fox Valley, Star Power. Uh, he ran first last week, and running first on your first time uh, off, he ran better than he did with Kelsey Perriman in his qualifier at Springfield. Uh, so I think he he's probably he'll probably be a favorite, but just because of Casey Leonard and he won last time out, so uh, he could be there. But if you're looking for a price in that one, I really like the six. So the seventh race, a one mile pace. Uh, purse of nine thousand. This horse is the best horse on the card. Single him. There's no other horse that could beat this horse. Number two, way more. He broke. He was on the lead. He broke around the back stretch. Came back. Took the lead over all horses in the six horse field. Had the lead around the stretch. And Casey Leonard pops the pocket and goes right by him. Runs second. DQ to fourth. This horse, if he doesn't leave the gate. As long as I think if they don't, they don't leave with them and going from, and going from Travis Seekman to Brandon Bates, or sorry, he even he even ran third. He did have to get into third. Brandon Bates from Travis Seekman. Brandon came out here, came out here for a reason. I think this is the horse why he came out. Uh, he was riding him at Hoosier. He won at Hoosier one time. This horse is real good. This horse is my single. He's just the best. Um, he's, he's just the best. He's the best horse. 
the eighth race here at Hawthorne on Sunday, May 12, 2019. Don't know if I mentioned that. Um, purse of 9,000. This is a one mile pace, non winners of honor uh, of 10,000 of 10,000 lifetime. Uh, my t one of my uh, my first pick here goes to the number one first time or he was first time started last time out this is his second start Casey Leonard takes the two over the nine which is Cal Houston so uh, Casey must know this horse is live and I like him my check mark goes to a good price hopefully when I mean, he goes off the number eight he has Tim Curtin from Michael Rogers First time start at Hawthorne. Ran a good solid third. Second time start. I think he could be there out of the eight hole. Those are my two selections for that race. The ninth race. Purse of $6,700. Uh, $6, $6, a one mile pace. Um, so my top selection here. Would go to the number the number two once again. He ran him one time in New York or Kyle Houston ran him one time in New York at Chester in a qualifier. Did okay. He ran in a qualifier at Hawthorne just to get him around the the track. Kyle Houston rode him. Ran first. He should be good. He's seven to two morning line right now. Uh, the number five I thought was interesting. He, ran, he was coming over from Northfield. He ran a solid second with Tim Curtin. Tim Curtin gets back on. He's the hot man out there right now. Um, he it was his. This is going to be his second time on the track. So, so two five is who I like in this one. And as from what I'm seeing right now is Brandon Bates has taken all Bobby Smolin's mounts. This horse, he's coming over. He shipped over from Hoosier. Ran eighth. This guy's a question mark to me because he, he didn't run a very good race last time out at Hawthorne. But maybe the driver change and second time on the track, he might be good. So those are my selections for Hawthorne race course. Uh, Sunday, May 12, 2019. Hope you guys enjoy and win some money.